Python, Java, JavaScript, Ruby are examples of special basic languages every programmer should know. They are used to develop software programs, scripts and other sets of instructions for computers to execute. But these languages can seem a bit overwhelming and confusing for a newcomer. Now, with your lang, a programming language designed to write small programs in Yoruba, Anuoluapo Karongwi makes learning to code easy for indigents of southwestern Nigeria. For every programming language, whenever you're starting out, you do need some, some, of, some sort of guidance, right? And um, the thing is, with your lang, when you see the keywords, like we have some keywords here that is um, she, which is an if statement in English. And when you read it, uh, word after word, it sort of makes sense to you. You don't really have to think too much about the logic because you are reading it in your mother's tongue if you are the type that understands things better in your mother tongue like I am. The features in Yolang uh, consist of basic features a programming language should have, like most C derived programming languages, so which is jerky. The documentation is actually quite clear, so it takes a step by step in a sense, but just like every other programming language out there, you still have to have some small guidance on how to do things because the documentation of the language is just a documentation. Now building programs with that, you see some small guidance, but it's easier because you are reading the syntax of your programming language in Yoruba, which is in Yoruba. What were the hiccups he faced along the way? There were some things I had to do that required a lot of something we call recursion. So it's a recursion at a very big level and wrapping my head around that was a bit confusing at the start. Then recursion then had backtracking with it for handling operator proceedings. So that was one challenge that was. Another challenge I faced um, was um, trying to get it to import other files within it uh, in a way whereby the file parts will not be difficult for the users of the language to understand. And yeah, I passed that all the time. Anuoluapo imagined people who think better in Yoruba would find it easy to understand programming as beginners if they could read the keywords in the language they were most familiar with. One thing I had in mind when I was creating it is to make it an educational tool, right? So for me, if we can, if I can get it to schools for kids that probably don't understand English all that too well, but might want to be interested in programming for some reason. You never know until you, you get a shot and try. So using Yolang as um, a map for them to compare, they still have to learn the proper programming languages, but getting into the programming space, understanding it in your mother tongue can make it easier to understand the languages you want to do. Anu Oluwakpo's aim is to ease the learning process of coding, as well as prove that local languages can have a place in the technology sphere. Thank you.